Hello everyone from a rainy day here in Arizona. I don't know about you, but sometimes I like going shopping on a rainy day. There, I, I either like to be cozied up on my couch you know, making a pot of chili, or I like to go shopping because it's a little cozy as well, kind of, unless you get like super wet, then it's not comfortable, but you get what I mean. Anyway, today I'm gonna go into Ivy and Sage. I've taken you there before. It's like a little home decor store, local home de decor store here in Arizona. And I'm going in there because I'm looking for a shallow terracotta pot. I want to do like a little herb garden in the pot or like a, you know, herb assortment. I I did find some on Amazon, so I'll link those down below, but I kind of was impatient and thought, let me go here, let's see if they have one, and if they don't, then I'll order one. But they are, there's also a world market in this little shopping center, so I figured we would go to both. So I'm gonna go in there, see what they have, take you along with me. It's been a couple months since I have done a world market shop with me, I believe. I took a little break because sometimes I go to stores too often and then they don't have new items, and then I feel like I need to to give it a break so that's what I did anyway I'm open to see what other items they have for like springtime summer decor all of that so we're gonna let's just get in here and now I'm chatting your ear off let's go let's see what world market has let's see what Ivy and Sage has and hopefully they have what I'm looking for they have the best taper candles here at world market I love them I also really like these iron candlesticks $19.99 for the small. And then they have these like swirly ones too. Oh, these are cute. These are really, really cute. I like them. Um, the brass actually looks pretty good, or like the, the gold. I love those. I love that it has the mirror at the bottom too because it helps the like flame and the candle just sparkle a little bit more. So good. Okay, these pots look new, 129, and they're actually rather large. I really, really like these. I also love this one, really beautiful. And I'm gonna say it, World Market has some of the best faux for the best prices. Olive tree, fiddle fig, that tree. Pretty dang good, I gotta say. These outdoor chairs are very unique. I haven't seen these, how cool. These napkins are beautiful. These would have been perfect for Easter, actually. I like those. $2.49 for these bar stools. These actually look really good. Wow. They really do look good, especially the rattan. Oh, wow. I'm impressed. Those are gorgeous. Okay, this chair is actually quite heavy. I was not expecting that. That's beautiful. I like this one, too. $1.49. And then this wishbone style chair, 249. You know my love for cocktail shakers. This one's 25. Oh, I like this. How beautiful. I also love these bowls, these little ramekins. I like the gray and the cream, and they come in a bigger size as well. Oh, I really like those. I think World Market's strength is their kitchenware and their glassware. Oh, also look, look what I found. Oh, look, $6.99. These, oh yes, 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 yes. And they're like very nice and thin. Stunning, stunning. These marble paper towel holders are gorgeous. Ooh, let me be careful, $19.99. They have some other ones with like patterns and things, but I really love the marble. Oh, I like this dish towel. It's like in this beautiful green. Oh, this one's pretty too. I have a friend that this would be perfect for. But I love these a lot. These are just beautiful. Love them. And they're so soft. I actually need this. It's really cute. How much is this? $19.99. These... This board set, set of three for $40 is so good, especially if you're gonna throw a party. I like those. They also have these marble slabs for 50. They're a 20 by 16. I can't pull it out, it's way too heavy, but 
These are perfect just to have out on your countertop or to do like a charcuterie board. Perfect. I love everything that's going on right here. Gorgeous. I love the print on these, the rattan with these, and the organic kind of pottery style of these. Oh, so good. I don't know if this comes in like your regular like brown tone rattan, but if it does, this is the perfect outdoor bar cart. I love this. Or even a guest bedroom. You could like do, you know, have the coffee pot and the, the all the stuff. This is so cute. How much is this? 300. Also, I stand by. They have some of the bas best baskets. Love their baskets, especially these. I've been eyeing these for so long. I love them. They're super hardy. Love them. Okay, I'm not like... I don't have like a beachy style, but I like these. $35. These are adorable marble little shell bookends. Those are cute. Picture light for $70. That's, I love that. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. There's a few options of like little mini lights, $70 for this green glass. Then this one, this one's 60. And actually, I really love that for a kitchen or even a bathroom. Beautiful. I love that rattan light right there, that scalloped edge. I love it. That's very cute. I think for a guest bedroom, I keep talking about a guest bedroom, but I feel like that's where you can kind of play and have a little fun. And I like that 130. It's really sweet. I have a feeling I'm gonna like this rug. Look at the pattern. It's beautiful. It has like, you know, I'm noticing that tan mixed with gray a lot lately, but you can see kind of the stripe. It seems like a really good quality. Six by nine. If you have a little bit more of that organic vibe to your space for 200. I've shared these like hanging baskets with you a few times. This one's in seagrass. I like these for certain areas. I feel like they can be really sweet. $13, just depending on where you put it, but I like them. And it comes in a bigger size, but it's all the way up there, so I can't see the price. So you get two size options. I don't know. I think they could be sweet. I still love this marble little tray for $13. I love a lip on a marble tray. I just feel like it adds so much more to it. What a night, people dancing in slow motion. Now, 
so we're gonna take a look around and see what they have they have a mixture of like new items vintage and just like good gift little things in here so we're gonna look around it's been a while since I've been in here as well but they have gorgeous things I love this tiny little mirror right here. This is so cute. 20. I don't think it's vintage, but I love it. Oh, I love this brass little measuring or ruler. $8.99. That's so sweet. Oh, brass bowl's cute too. They have these pots here for 30. I love these, but maybe I'm gonna have to do it on its own. I was talking to one of the girls here and she said that Herbs can be super, like, takeover. It doesn't have a drainage hole either, but I think it'd be simple to drill one in there. I am just swooning over this entire little room right here. It is so me. I love this and super fun to look at all of the little things. Just the different things they have in here. It's just super cool. I love the matches. I think this would be so cool to collect matches in, like, you know, a room that might have like you know all your little trinkets on your from your vacations but this room is so cute i love it this tray right here is really cool 30 dollars i like that it has like little feet and shape and look at the handles it's so pretty <laughs> store to see just to see if they had a kumquat and they do they have a kumquat over here i think it's let's see where is it not that one i think it's this little guy down here right here but this isn't the kumquat i think i want it starts with an m i believe but it's killing me because i'm like wait a minute i've been waiting for a kumquat i want a kumquat so bad but then, look at this little Meyer lemon tree. You guys, I am freaking out. Look. Oh my gosh, I have to get this and put it in the backyard in our little back patio. And then when we get the house, we will replant this. But this wasn't the plan. And I wanted, oh wait, maybe they have a kumquat that's smaller. Okay, so this is kind of what I was after because I think these ones are like $20, where this one is 47. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, I'm like, honestly, like freaking out. This is just the sweetest thing I've ever seen. But then, okay, if they have a kumquat for 20, I can get both, but then otherwise I just gotta decide on one or the other because I that wasn't in the budget. So these are all lemon. They might have a kumquat in here though. I'm gonna dig and I'm gonna look. And I could get a little Meyer lemon, you know, for the $20, but it doesn't have the little lemons on it. Like, how do I not take this home? You've gotta be kidding me. I am, <laughs> I am freaking out. Oh my gosh. I'm ready to plant my new Meyer lemon tree. I am so excited. This is not where I was planning for the video to go, but I am beyond excited. Those little lemons had me at hello. I just <laughs> So I have my other lemon tree right here, which is going strong, but I've been wanting a Meyer lemon. My friend was telling me basically to get a Meyer lemon. She just said like the skin's being softer and you can use them for different things, but you also need a hardier lemon as well. Ow, that has like a thorn. Um, ow. So anyway, I'm gonna get this 
planted, the only thing I'm nervous about is if I have enough soil for this pot. And then I'm gonna give clean the pot and clean this pot. I'm so excited. I am so excited. This kind of thing just like brings me so much joy. I just, I'm so excited. Okay, let's do this. I'm always nervous of getting in the soil because one time I was planting something and I had a frog in the bag of soil and I freaked out. My mom had to get it out of it, out of the bag for me because I couldn't do it. Here she is. I am so in love. You can see she has some blooms on here too. But these little lemons, I am freaking out. They make me so happy. I also have them in some old pots that I painted black. These are just terracotta pots that I painted black a few years ago. Kind of wish I didn't do that now that I'm like into the terracotta, but it's what I had for now. If I find something better in the future, I'll, I'll swap them out into that or when they get bigger. But you guys, look at how beautiful. Oh my gosh. I am so happy with my new Meyer lemon tree out here. It just is so, so sweet. Isn't it funny how a plant can make you this happy? I don't know if I'm the only one, but they just make me really happy. All right, and the next, I'm going to plant these babies in my pots over here. I thought I had soil, but I don't have any more soil. So I'm gonna have to go back to the store, but I have basil, rosemary, and thyme. I am I actually have never purchased thyme before, so I'm excited. I heard it's like really good with chicken. Let me know what else it's good with, but I'm excited. Hopefully I can keep these alive this time because I haven't had the best luck with herbs, but I just, I love them. I was gonna put them all in one big pot, but like I said, the lady at Ivy and Sage said that especially rosemary and basil kind of take over and they don't like to share their soil, so it will smother the other herbs. So I'm gonna have to research a little more and see how I can mix it up. But I have these pots, so I'm gonna put them in here for now and hopefully get them potted either later today or tomorrow, but oh my gosh. I love this time of year. I would say we were good together.